What's going on YouTube? Uh, I just wanted to make a quick video as a response to the original video I made about the builder pattern in the move class because uh, a guy commented on the on the video and got me thinking about how it was kind of a broken way of using a class. I had one class that I was using for two really different purposes so I now have two classes. We have a move object which is just an immutable wrapper class for two coordinates. This gets juggled around a lot and we have a not PGN, that's for a whole PGN file. PGN move. So we have this class which is the one I went over in the previous video. And this move is I mean this we only create a PGN move class after you see we uh, we make sure the move is okay and then if it's okay we get a PGN move of it so we call refine move and then we send that refined move back to the controller so the um, the board class actually doesn't know anything yeah see we don't need this to be a PGN move we can just have the board class be completely oblivious of PGN moves. So that's nice. It's a lot cleaner way of setting things up. Cache set of move. The move list is just regular moves. Return. Uh, yeah. Anyway, so it's a lot cleaner. The um, the two functions are completely separate now, and I have one more error I have to fix get move list yeah just a set of regular old moves I debated whether the board shouldn't have PGN moves so that when you ask the board for its move list you get a you get a standard list but I don't think so I think the board can just be a lot more a lot more basic and if you really did need a list of PGN moves you could call maybe have a set of moves and have the board you know run those moves while saving all the PGN moves and maybe return a set of PGN moves. Maybe have one static function of board that will take a set of move and turn it to PGN move. Let me go ahead. Public static set of PGN move. Convert set to PGN set of move. Set. Um, set. Result set. Linked hash set because it has to be ordered. That's the difference between hash set and linked hash set. Regular hash set does not maintain original order. I could just use hash set but tag each move with a number for whether it was you know, for which move it was, but I don't want to do that. Uh... Okay. Anyway, so that's the, um, that's the way I have the move class set up. Thanks for watching.